All right, so I'm going to show you how to get specific colors into your um, projects um, by using a color hex code. So I created a simple Google slide here. Um, I'm going to change the background. I'm going to change this word art, um, and I'm going to change the regular text too so that you can see the different ways to customize the color using the hex code. So the first thing I'm going to do is look for a color palette I like. So I just Google pastel colors hex. And you'll see that there's colors here that have these little numbers under it. And those are called hex codes for each color. Um, you can use websites like colorhex.com, schemecolor.com. There's a lot of different websites you can use. I'm going to go with the schemecolor.com because I like this palette and I just like that website too. So if I click on that one, which I already have open here. You see that there's the palette. So the matching colors are already there. And the hex codes are down here, but it also has this copy code button. So I'm going to get the color from there. So I'm going to make my background a lighter color. So I'm going to go with this beige color. So I'm going to click the copy code. To change the background, I'm going to click background, color, and then custom. And right here where it says hex, I'm going to delete this and paste the hex code. Done. All right, so now I have that color. Now I want this title to be a different color from that palette, so I'm gonna go back and I'm going to make it this purple color. So I'm gonna click copy code. I'm gonna click on the word art. This one you fill in with the fill color bucket. So I'm gonna go to custom and I'm going to paste the hex code. Okay, there we go. And for this one, it has a black line, so I can either take it off or I can add a different color line, whichever one I want. I could also go back and change it to a hex code color if I want. All right, now the subtitle, I want that a different color for my palette. So I'm going to go with the, let's go with the green. So I'm going to copy the code, go back here. This is a regular text box, so I just changed the regular text color, custom and paste and okay and there you have it now if that's too light i can always go back and say hmm, maybe i want the orange so i'm going to click it custom paste okay yeah it's a little brighter um and that's basically it so the cool thing about your colors once if you're using those colors repeatedly through your slideshow is that now whenever you click on that color, the custom colors stay there for you to just click and use over and over again. Um, one more thing that kind of makes your text pop is if you add a drop shadow, so I kind of like that too. All right, hope that helps.